Hey guys, what's going on? Alton here and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get zero lag and no input delay when streaming with Streamlabs OBS. So let's get right into it. I'm just going to show you guys my settings and I'm going to show you one little trick that I found out pretty recently. So you just skip this, skip this tab, go straight to output, make sure your output mode is on advanced, audio track set to whichever track you're obviously you have your audio on, encoder, 100% put this on hardware and Venk new. If you're streaming Fortnite in particular, do not put this on software because that will just make your game lag and most likely not look as good as it could. So make sure you have it on the newest version possible. This is your graphics card, by the way, and this is your CPU. Make sure you enforce streamer service encoder settings. Rate control, I have it on CBR and I use 7,500 bitrate. As a Twitch partner, I can use up to 8K but I don't always reach 8K since my upload speeds are not the best. But for you guys, I would just recommend setting it to 6K. And if you're feeling lag, try 5.5. There's not a big difference in quality and you should feel quite good. A keyframe interval zero preset to quality, not max, because this will again take a, take a bit of lag off the game. Profile set to high. Again, these are my settings. So I could also make a video for low-end computers if you guys are interested. But yeah, if you have a low-end PC, make sure to set that to main. It shouldn't make too much of a difference. Then you guys go to video, base canvas resolution 1920, 1080. Output scaled resolution. Again, you can either do the one I'm doing, 1600 by 900 or 1280 by 720. Don't do 12 or sorry, 1920 by 1080 on one computer. It just, it will, it really won't give you the best results and you will, you will most likely feel quite a bit of lag if you do use that, especially on one computer. But here guys, this is the one trick that I found out recently that's actually been just crazy. Like I never actually thought something like this could give me no input delay. But if you guys just pull this up all the way or even just keep a little bit, so you, if you really want to see your stream, you know, you can. This removes so much input input delay, you don't even understand. I used to stream and I had, I think, like this much space or I had it like this, pretty much exactly a few lines of alerts and then a huge screen. And then this is when I was lagging a lot. And somebody told me if I pull this all the way up and leave a little bit, it will remove a lot of my lag. And it did. And it's honestly pretty nuts. There's a little trick that I forgot to mention in the actual video. If you actually just right click here, click performance mode, it just completely disables this and you can still keep this at the same size that you had it before. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys how I get zero lag while streaming. Sometimes obviously I can feel it a bit, but for the most part, it's quite crazy to be honest that I can, you know, not feel input delay on one computer. But apart from that, everybody, if you did enjoy the video, make sure to drop a like. And if I did help you or if I didn't help you, drop a comment and I'll make sure to respond to every single person. But apart from that, have a great rest of your day.